Hey, what's poppin' you guys? Sizzle here, back again with the black and white two live decks. And now that I'm actually looking at the correct area, uh, this is definitely where you catch it. I don't know why, why I didn't see that. Um, I'll use a paralyzed seal because being paralyzed is annoying. But yeah, there's a 30% chance of Pylo Swine, 20% for Clefairy, 15% for Ditto, 10% Lunatone, 10% Solrock, 10% Matang, and 5% Delibird. I've already caught Delibird, Lunatone, and Clefairy, and I believe we've also caught Pylo Swine, but if we haven't, then you know, whatever. Uh, anyway, I guess I should have put this thing asleep first so it can't transform, but it's going to have one health when it transforms and we're faster, so it doesn't really matter. We're it's faster, or is mean look priority? I guess mean look might be priority. I kind of forgot about that. Either way, we weren't planning on swapping. So let's go quickly catch this ditto. And, uh, yeah. Could throw a master ball at it, that'd be kind of funny. But I think I'd do a heal ball, because it goes better with the ditto's color scheme. I do actually at some point have to look into how all the different Pokeballs work. Right now I'm just going off of, like, vague assumptions I have instead of actual raw numbers. Yeah, what do I call Ditto? Uh, this is like the breeding one. I don't know, I'm thinking of Fergus, Ferguson. I don't even know where this name could be from, I'll, I'll keep it a stack. But yeah, uh, there, uh, there's us catching Ditto, which came surprisingly early. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one.